Monitor Audio was founded in 1972. I've been with the company since 1976. Back then, we were based in Cambridge with a staff of around six people. We were producing models at that time, like the MA1, MA3, MA4 and MA5, which were designed and developed by Moet Bell, the founder. Today, the home of Monitor Audio is down here in Rayleigh, where we have a 43,000 square foot facility serving our international customers and our UK retailers. Here we have our design team, our development team, our finance, our sales support and our marketing team as well as our warehouse where all our products are kept. So the process in which we develop all loudspeakers is exactly the same from whether it's our entry level bronze series to our flagship platinum series. We lavish the same kind of time and effort into every loudspeaker range. Of course, the critical stage in what we actually do at Monitor Audio here is listen to the loudspeakers first and foremost, the most important thing. But along the way, we will cross-check. We'll take the loudspeaker into the chamber, do some measurements, and then also back into the demo room and start listening again. And it's an iterative approach between demo room listening and into the chamber for actual testing. From the concept stage of producing a loudspeaker, we go into the sketching phase, where we generally uh, will do sketching in the industrial design department, as well as actually some acoustic FEA modelling. Yeah, I believe Monitor Audio is pretty unique in the audio world anyway, for having its, its own industrial design team, especially the, the size of the team we've got here. That means we can take a concept to scribble on, on a bit of paper, a sketch, to the production line without having to bring too many cooks into the kitchen. We might be running you know, anywhere between six to ten projects at any one time. Every designer's got a project. Once the, the project has been greenlit, that person will start doing the research, whether that's you know, market research, going out into the field, interviewing people, uh, trying to uh, really figure out what the, what the best solution is, find out what our rivals are doing, if they're doing anything at all. They really you know, get into what the product needs to be, and then we can select a few of those ideas and just keep taking them forward. So the design concept stage at Monitor Audio is a collaborative effect. Generally, concepts are created in two ways. Firstly, from blue sky meetings. And secondly, it could come from a sales requirement. Maybe this is a hole in the market that we see. Traditional audio will always form the core part of our business. However, there's been a growing demand for custom installation products in recent years. Monitor was very keen to use everything that we know and everything that we have learned about our traditional products to design and create a full range of custom installation products offering people solutions for distributed sound or even complicated high-end home cinemas and as part of that mix we have our sound frame where customers are able to specify their own pictures or choose from a library that we have available on our website. So when we conceive a product range we start with a completely clean slate this usually means that we've started you know, from complete scratch we never really take into consideration the previous series you know, over the years, we've tried to simplify what we do, a very much a less is more approach. You look at a radius series, you know, it, there's nothing to it. You know, that's, that's quite hard to achieve um, from a design point of view. You know, the, the design challenge is to create that simplicity. You know, literally every screw has to be designed to, to be within a certain tolerance and is bespoke. Uh, and that's what having our own industrial design team can do. I think a lot of our rivals would probably find that too costly, outsourcing that, that amount of workload. We realised that obviously, you know, Monitor Audio, we've always been very successful in, in audio design. So I think it was, yeah, 2013, we entered the Red Dot Awards for the first time, which is a, uh, a quite a well sought after award, in, uh, worldwide award, but based in Germany. Uh, and yeah, for the three years, three awards uh, since then, so it's, uh, we, we've done well there. So it's good to know that uh, you know, we're, we can compete at a, a world level, and both acoustically uh, and, and with the industrial design. We at Monitor Audio believe to make a great sounding loudspeaker, all the key fundamental principles need to be in place. Products that are made with pride and passion, products that deliver incredible quality and sound of music, and products that people will be very proud to own. It's quite important to stress, I think, that that's what we do here. You know, nearly, nearly everything we, we, 
make uh, is bespoke.